Hello, my fellow nerds out there. It's Uncle Nerd and welcome to three scary games. Now, I I picked out three random games for this video, thankfully, so I don't have to just you know go through each of the games, download it, and then continue the video from there. Um, so I'm only I'm only making this video mostly because of a. Uh, well, I'm pretty sure some of you probably already know because of Easter. So anyways, I'm playing three scary games. This one is called Monophobia, and this one actually connects to me on a bit of a spiritual level because, well, strangely enough, well, it's mostly because I myself am monophobic. I, I, I fear being alone. I don't like being alone. I hate being alone. I, I, love, I love to have interaction with people. I love talking to my friends and, you know, all that. So this game really spoke to me as someone who is monophobic. And I've never really seen this one myself. So let's go ahead and dive straight in. Oh god, my mouse is pretty laggy for this one. Uh, I like to... I like to live. Oh, I have to use the arrow keys. Okay, let's... let's start. Oh. <coughs> oh. I wonder who this person is. Another sleepless night. I'm too tired to get up. No. Oh! I need to work on my project. Is it morning? Time is it? I wonder how long it has been since everyone has just disappeared. I have become the last living thing on earth. It's not like this has affected me. I haven't left my house even before everything, every living thing on Earth had vanished. It has been years since the phenomenon. Nothing has changed for me. I am still living the life. some months, but I should turn the lights on. This is interesting. Oh? Oh, do I get to interact? Oh! Oh, whoa, whoa, what was that? Been able to interact with anything yet? I should get some work done. Oh wait, am I in? Oh, I'm in! Oh, this is interesting. Okay, it doesn't seem like I can run anywhere. Uh, I want to look around a little bit. Oh, I move so slowly. breakfast first? The art style kind of reminds me of Animal Crossing a little bit. Although the walking sound could be a little bit different. Wait, is that... 
Wait, does my, does my shadow travel along? Oh, it doesn't. Oh, I was really hoping my shadow would actually travel along depending on, like, where I am, right? How do I interact with things? It's not enter, it's not Z. Maybe, maybe, I, maybe I can leave? I can't leave. Hmm. Um, well, it seems like I can't really interact with anything here. Uh, wow, this is probably the shortest game I've ever played. Uh, but this is just a de this is just a demo though, so maybe the dev will add something to it that we can interact with. So I guess for now let's move on to the next game. Okay, so this game is called Missing Hiker. This is another game that I found on Itch.io. I thought it was one. It's another one of those uh, VHS games, I think, or PSX ones. It's kind of like those kinds of styles, and I always love those styles. You have, you probably know how much I love them from how I. From uh, the building, the uh, building seventy one incident, uh, the 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 gas station one. I don't remember what it was called. Um, I think so. We're gonna be playing Missing Hiker. This is the second game of this video, so let's get right into it. Play. Oh, jeez. December eleventh, nineteen ninety four. My brother Ethan is missing from around twenty for around twenty four hours. Wait, you mean Crank Game Plays is missing? <laughs> he went on a hiking trip near the Red Mountain. He should have come home yesterday. I went to the local police. They said they don't have the resources for search right now. So I decided to take matters into my own hands. Oh. Hey. Hey. Oh, gosh. <laughs> that That's my car light. Whoops. Oh, I'm actually driving! Uh, okay. Oh, this- oh, this reminds me of, a uh, frickin'... What's it called? Uh, what's that? Uh, what was it? Um, Happy Humble's Burger Barn, where, you, where you're driving into work. Maybe I should probably keep my vision forward. Oh god. Ooh. Ooh. Some signs over here. Yo, the dude, the moonlighting looks so nice. Okay, the game's a little laggy on laptop, but you know what? As long as it works, it works. Jesus. Okay, turn. I was I was never that great at driving at IRL, so <laughs> Oh Jesus. There are actually other cars on this road. Okay. Oh my god, it's so sensitive. I should park at the gas station to ask if they saw my brother. Oh, I still am. Proceed to exit car. All right. Oh. Oh, wow, it runs much smoother outside the car. First, I have to use flashlight. 
Okay. Alright, uh, I'm sorry if the footage is a wee bit laggy. Oh, dude, I feel like a giant right now. I feel like a giant compared to these doors. Hello! Oh, hi! Okay, I should probably turn off the flashlight since there's light in here. Ooh. Hey, buddy. What can I do, do you for, for you, sir? I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking around this area. He should have come home yesterday. Have you seen him? How does your brother look like? He has brown hair and is pretty tall. He also has a green backpack. Hmm, let me think for a second. Hmm, yes, I think I saw your brother. He came in here and bought a few things. Some water and a few snacks. You're trying to find him? Have you told the police already? Yes, I did, in fact. But they said they don't have the resources for a search right now. They said they only they only start a search if a person is missing for more than 48 hours. <clears throat> if it is, it isn't the first time someone went missing in this area. At least a handful of people went missing missing there there in the last decade. People talk a lot. I've heard rumors that there are strange screams and weird noises coming from the woods. So you should be careful, especially going there at this time of night. There's a road right behind the gra right behind the gas station, <clears throat> leading to the mountain. Make sure to stay on it. There could be dangerous wildlife in that area. Thanks. I'll make sure to stay safe. Take care. All right. Thanks, dude. Okay. Do we get to drive there? No. Oh, we have. Do we have to walk there? Oh, hello, trash place. Oh, dude, the moon effect is just so nice. I can barely see in front of me though. Oh, this is the road he means, right? Okay, yeah, that sign says no people, so... Oh, I can still see the gas station from here. Nice. Actually, are we, are we sure I can't just go and get my car first? I'm pressing E. It's not letting me in. station now oh I see the path okay Oh, I can run. Okay, thank God I can run. Seems like I have unlimited stamina as well.
What the hell? Uh, what just happened? Oh, I opened something on my... I opened something on my computer. <laughs> Whoops. From here, Roberta's ten looks entirely different. I should take a closer look. What do you mean by that? kind of scared. We can run backwards? Oh, I can run backwards. Nice. Stay on the path. Is this path gonna go for? Wait, can I pause? Oh, I can pause. Nice. Uh, is there like a? Okay, it doesn't seem to be like a any sort of. Doesn't seem to be any sort of like brightness feature on here. I'm probably gonna have to turn the brightness on on my own computer. Uh, here we go. Oh god, honestly, dark, scary corridors kind of give me the frights, I won't lie. <laughs> oh gosh. Okay, so after doing a little review, I seem to have made a mistake. I'm, ac I'm actually supposed to go back there and look at the tent. At least I think I am. So, that actually is the tent that I was supposed to look at. <laughs> oh, whoops! Honestly, it didn't look like a tent. It looked like a building for some reason. <clears throat> and plus, the guy said to stay on the path, so... <laughs> That's just a smear on my screen. I keep thinking it's a tree. Take a look. Oh, Jesus Christ! What the? Whoa, whoa, who the fuck are you? You scared the shit out of me! I scared you? I almost had a heart attack myself! I almost had a heart attack myself! What do you want? I hope you're not some kind of pervert or creep. I'm not. I'm searching for my brother. He was hiking in this area. Have you seen him? Nope, I haven't seen him. Wait. You don't even know how he, what he looks like? Look, man, I'm just some guy that likes to hike in, in a wood, uh, hike in the woods and sleep in a tent in freezing conditions. I haven't seen anyone in days. I understand. You're planning to go deeper into the forest? Yes, I'll search around the area. I hope I can find my brother, or at least traces of him. Look, you probably think I'm a stoner or something, but last night I had my tent bit a bit up north, and I heard weird noises coming from the woods. It sounds like a child was crying, but I didn't see anything. It creeped me out. Maybe it was a cryptid? A what? Look, man, 
Do you carry? What do you mean? I'm talking about a piece, you know, something for protection. You mean a gun? No, I don't. Then you shouldn't be here in the first place. It's way too dangerous to go deeper into the into the forest at night. But I'm not but I'm not going to stop you. I just want you I just want to sleep now. Also, one last thing. Don't creep up a tent in the woods at night ever again. I almost would have shot you. Well, I guess I'm glad you didn't. Me too. Good luck with the search. Alright. Thanks, I suppose. Some help you were. Hmm. I guess I can probably... Oh my god, this path is taking forever. Okay, like, let, let, let's talk for a second. If, if your family is missing in the woods from a hike, you probably should send a search party out to go and find them. Don't go looking for them yourself. It's it's dangerous like this. I would know from experience because I was a part of a scout troop at one point. And you should always remember the buddy system. You should always go with someone at the very least. Don't go alone. All right, let's go ahead and continue. Yeah, sorry if I'm stopping this video every now and then. It's just the little things I know. It's like the snow falling down, the moon shining from the sky. Really hope nothing attacks me. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I should just talk to that other bloke that was in the, the gas station. <coughs> God, this path is so long. How am I gonna... When am I gonna get to another checkpoint? Oh... That's such a... Oh, that's such a pretty nice view, though. It's getting really cold. I should set up my tent on the left side of the road. Okay... I mean, this looks like a good spot. Then, good spot fitting. My fingers are pretty numb. It's hard to build a tent. Ooh. Proceed to enter tent. Ooh, I have a pretty fancy tent. It's cold, but I'm falling asleep slowly. I think I heard someone scream. Not sure if it was real or imagined. Um, I would just not worry about it and just go back to sleep. I need to check. It could be my brother screaming for help. No, come, come on, dude. Really? That's a, that's like basic horror trope number one. Don't ever go out if you hear a scream. Like, like, wouldn't it be, wouldn't it be better to just stay inside the tent? Like, come on, people. All right, fine. Eat an exit. I actually heard that. There's a light deeper in the woods. I need to see if that could be my brother. Oh, I see it, I see it, I see it, I see it.
Shouldn't we, shouldn't we stay on the path, though? Christ on a bike. This is gonna be horrible, isn't it? Like, come on, dude. What did the gas station guy tell you? To stay on the path, right? I'm just gonna run. Another building? There's, there's a building over there. Oh, don't tell me that. That looks like what is? Is that what I think it is? Oh, you gotta be kidding me! No, no flashlight! No. Do not be going out on me. What is this? My brother's backpack, he must have been here. E to inspect. Weird, the backpack is completely empty, nothing in here. Guys, this is the death of me. This is this is literally the death of me. Uh say goodbye to my say goodbye to my head. Hello? What the hell? Someone made a picture of my tent and my car? Fucking hate this. Can I please just leave? <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ! <laughs> Jesus Christ! Your body was never found? Jesus Christ, they gave me a fucking heart attack! My god, dude! Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, okay, so from what I read, there should be like two other endings, right? There could be like two different, two other endings, right? Um, but I don't know. I mean, that's probably the only ending that I can think of right now, so. Oh, Jesus. Um, let, let's go ahead and move on to the third game. My god, this one gave me such a heart attack. Alright, er okay, everybody. Whew. Now that we got out of the hiking trip, welcome back to Amanda the Adventurer. Yes, do you guys remember this game when we played the demo of it before? Well, now it's a full, a full blown demo this time. <clears throat> and my goodness, it, it got a major update as of last time we played this. Um, let, without further ado, let's go ahead and start. <clears throat> oh, I like how the loading screen is just the, the VHS thing. That's so cool. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh, we actually get to move around. It's a full 3D space. Oh, this oh this looks so nice. Oh, it runs so smoothly. Oh, this is gonna be the best thing ever. Okay. My desk it seems. Uh, channel three play. What's this? Amanda the adventurer in the kitchen. Okay. 
Oh, it's so cool. Hi, I'm Amanda. And I'm Wooly. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. My favorite is peach pie. Today, we're going to make an apple pie. First, we need to cut the apples. Hmm, do you know what we can use to cut the apples? Um... <laughs> okay, I'm gonna say... A knife? Good job! Oh! We can use a sharp knife. Uh, I don't think we're supposed to do that by ourselves. It's always good to be brave when you're by yourself. Uh... Look, I'm a pirate! Oh! <laughs> That doesn't seem safe. I agree okay, with Wooly. Let's cut the apples. Oh, oh. That was hard. We have almost everything we need to make our pie. We just need some sugar. Hmm, do you know where we keep the sugar? <coughs> Is it in the pantry, the refrigerator, or the sink? Um, oh, oh, we have to get to choose. Oh, this is so nice. Uh, sugar is kept in the pantry, right? Great, let's make a pie. I like how happy they are. Mm, can you smell the apples and cinnamon? I'm actually craving okay, some apple pie right now. it's time to bake a pie. First, preheat the oven to 425. I don't think we should be using the oven by ourselves. We should always ask a parent to help. I'm not sure where they are right now. Oh. We're on our own, Willie. First, preheat the oven to 425 degrees. Then, put the apples into the pie tin. Now, put it in the oven and bake it for 40 minutes. Our pie is ready! I can't wait to eat it! <coughs> What's your favorite kind of pie? Um... Oh, we have six letters. Uh, my favorite kind of pie? I mean, my favorite kind of pie is pumpkin, but that doesn't fit into the thing. Um... Your kind of pie. Uh, what's a six-letter word for something that's a, that can be a pie? Uh, I see this key lime, pumpkin, lemon. I, my favorite is key lime, so I'm just gonna go with key lime. Mmm, that sounds delicious. Willie, let's have some pie. Okay. All right. There goes the tape. Uh. That definitely was not there before. Um, this is weird. Okay, nothing in here. So I have four hundred. Wait, do I actually have to do what they didn't the think? I'm assuming so. Oh. Oh, we actually have to set the timer first. Okay. Okay, so now set the timer. And there we go. Uh, what? Another tape. Imagine the adventure... Wait, that says in the kitchen. Is this something different? Oh, this is really nice though. I like solving puzzles to get the tape. Hi, I'm Amanda. And I'm We're at a petting zoo. Uh that doesn't seem safe. Uh What's going on? Ooh! We don't have much time. Oh, fully? Uh, 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 um, what's going on? Hello? Uh, oh fuck! Oh shit! What, what the? F what was that? Whoa. Okay. Honestly, wow. I am. Actually surprised by all that. That was amazing. I I like that. I like that a lot. Um But yeah, uh thank you guys so much for watching this video. Uh be sure to leave a like, 
Comment what you think, share this with your friends, and be sure to subscribe and click the bell so you don't miss a single notification. I'll see all of you in the next video. Goodbye.